Hi, and welcome to another tutorial from Florida PC Nerds. Um, on this tutorial, I um, will walk you through uh, through the simple steps of removing the search bar that is built in on Internet Explorer 7. As you can see, uh, for many of you that have downloaded Internet Explorer 7, it brings a built-in um, search bar. You can um, you can customize it, you know, by uh, choosing your own search provider and everything, right? But for some of you, this feature is very annoying. I know for me it is. I didn't ask for it to be there. I don't like no toolbars on my browser. I don't like no search bars on my browsers. For that, I mean, I have my own. I mean, I have my um my home page set up to Yahoo. Sometimes you know my other computers is set up to Google, right? So there's no need for me to have a search bar. Yes, it is very convenient, but not for me. Um some of you might like it, some of us don't. So um for those who don't like it there, I will show you how to remove it. First, let's go to start. Choose run. On the wrong box, type regedit. That'll be R E G E D I T. Press enter or OK. Uh, open local machine. Double click on it. Open software. Go down to policies. open up Microsoft go down to Internet Explorer open info delivery and lastly <laughs> click on the restrictions key as you can see there's nothing here what we're going to do is going to create a a value, a uh, word value, uh, for us to hide the search bar. So right click, new, word value. We're gonna call it no search box. Press enter. Double click on it. And uh, where it says value, value data, set it up to one. Press OK. Close. And we need to restart the browser. So we're going to close it. And we're going to open it again. Voila. There you go. It's no longer there. If at one point in time you still want, you know, the um, the search bar to appear again, all you have to do is go back to the same key and uh, just um, change the value to zero. On some computers you're not going to have uh, all the correct values, for example. On some computers you might not have, whenever you go down to policy, you might not have Internet Explorer. Therefore, you're not going to be able to go through the, the whole thing, right? Well, it's very simple. All we have to do is create a new reference to it. Uh, I'm going to close this down. Okay, to add the register values to the register editor, um, what we're going to do is um, we're going to create our own registry file. And um, to do that, we're going to go, we're going to open, we're going to do it in Notepad. The easiest way to do that is go to start, choose one, and type in Notepad. N O T E P A D. Press OK or Enter. When once Notepad is open, you're going to type in the following: Windows Registry Editor version 5.0. Um, policies, Microsoft Internet Explorer, Info Delivery Restrictions. As you can see, it goes slowly here. So as you can see it.
<laughs> Write it down exactly the same way you see it here. As you can see, no search box and the value set to one. Do not forget is only don't don't forget to uh, write down the exact amount of zeros. That'll be one, two, three, four, five, six zeros, and then the one. Okay. Once you have that written down on Notepad, you're gonna go to click on File, Save As, and you're going to you can name it anything you want. In my case, I will name it Remove Search Bar. After I place the name. I want to name it in a way that it will be a register file, so I will add the extension. Press it, press, press it dot, and then you add R E G. So it's supposed to read remove search bar dot reg. Press OK or save. Close it down, and as you can see, the file is already there. Once the file has been created, all you have to do is just double click on it and uh, it's gonna ask you if you really want you know if you're really sure you want to add this information to the registry um, just click on yes and once it's, it is successfully entered in the registry it's gonna give you this warning and uh, you press ok um, as you know I mean once you uh, open an explorer um, the search bar will not be there now this process is not recommended for uh, people who has very extremely little experience with computers it is not a uh, it is not wise to play around with the registry especially if you do not know what you're doing um, in that case what I did I created a file I created that same file and I downloaded it to my website you can uh, go to my website and uh, download it um, the file is located on Let's go to my website, Florida FLPC Nerds, FLPCNerds.com. Go to the process that says uh, Downloads. As you can see, this is a link that says uh, Remove Internet Explorer 7 search, bo search bar, built in search bar on E7. Just click on it, and it's going to take you to the page. And um, like I said, all you have to do is download it click to here to download download it uh, click on save save it to the desktop and uh, that's about it and just go ahead once it's saved just go ahead open it and happy browsing good luck until next time